What do the Pisces tarot cards reveal for your mid-May 2024? Hey Pisces fam, get ready to dive deep into the mystical waters of tarot as we explore the cosmic energies shaping your mid-May. The planets are aligning in fascinating ways and we're here to uncover what the cards have in store for you. Welcome to your Pisces Tarot Predictions for mid-May 2024. This period holds significant importance for our sensitive and intuitive Pisces friends as the universe has some powerful messages to deliver. Let's unlock the secrets hidden within the cards and see what guidance they have for you. Beautiful Pisces. All right. Okay. Let's see. Let's see. Let's get into it. Definitely some um, Taurus coming up in your reading, some Libra in your reading. Um, yeah. So you can watch this video for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus. Cross, wa cross watchers are welcome, but you may also have um, some Libra or some Taurus in your birth chart. So take it how it resonates as I read intuitively. Offering the general insights and guidance for you, please take what resonates with you and to leave the rest, okay? All right, Pisces, let's find out what's going on. You know, as we step into mid-May, Pisces may encounter some challenges, okay, or obstacles, right? Uh, on your path, Pisces, it's essential to acknowledge that these potential hurdles um, so we can better understand how to navigate them, okay? This is beautiful so far. So, you know, whether, <clears throat> excuse me, whether it's emotional turmoil, relationship issues, or self-doubt, the tarot will shed light on how to overcome these challenges with grace and wisdom, Pisces, okay? So what I'm seeing in your area of challenge or resistance, Pisces, I'm getting this for every sign so far for mid-month. Each sign seems to be having the same issue, and it looks like, Pisces, you are no different. You're having a hard time connecting to your in inner wisdom, you're having a hard time connecting to your inner wisdom. And this is holding you back um, because it's time to choose a new path for your life. This You don't have to leave your life to fate, Pisces. You can absolutely create your own destiny. So because this is very interesting to me, this energy for mid-May for the signs have been... The challenge has been for the signs, the zodiacs, to get still, get quiet, and connect with their inner wisdom. In Pisces, you are you are no different. With the hierophant coming up in your area of resistance and challenge, okay. But let's let's take it from the top. Let's see what insights the cards hold for Pisces. This is justice. Justice will be done. Adjustments will need to be made. Okay, Pisces, as you know, each of these cards that are drawn, they have a unique story to tell, offering the guidance and clarity in the face of adversity. So I'm going to do my best with the help of spirit to interpret the messages from the tarot and unravel the deeper meanings they hold for you during this transformative period, Pisces. Okay, so what I'm feeling for your current energies, you have the justice card coming up, right? And again, that is the, this is uh, Libra. So you may have Libra in your birth chart, Pisces. Um, hopefully that information is available to you. So with this justice card coming up as your current energy, there is, there is legal legalities legalities am i saying that properly that i'm feeling for you and justice will be done things will come out in your favor absolutely spirit is brilliant thank you thank you spirit <clears throat> 
Spirit is telling you, trust that justice will be done on your behalf. Tr justice will be done on your behalf, Pisces, because the star card has come up, right? Um, this is beautiful. I'm just, I'm getting the the goosebumps right now. It's, it's feeling amazing. Um, so there is fairness for you. Your current energies. I'm feeling there is fairness that you you are sitting in that. You are standing on truth that things are turning out in your favor. That is the current energies. And with the Justice card, you have the Star card and the Hierophant. The Star card and the Hierophant showing up for your current energies. I feel like with this Hierophant, you are leaning heavily on your faith to keep you grounded to keep your beliefs high and, and believe that justice is in your favor. All fairness points to you. Um, with this high, high refund card, that's what I'm feeling. You are, you are seated heavily and you are seated firmly in your faith. And then we have the star card also clarifying the justice card for you. Okay. And then with the star card, you do have... Um, Aquarius showing up and with the Hierophant you have Taurus showing up so any of these zodiacs could be in your birth chart uh, Pisces okay so with this star card definitely definitely um, being inspired by your faith staying hopeful uh, with your star card showing up right I love this I love this this is this is amazing you your faith being grounded and seated in your faith it brings you power. That's what I'm feeling for you, Pisces. That's when you are at your most powerful state, at your most confident state. And yet we have the Hierophant, again, showing up as a challenge. It's like, so do not, what I'm feeling, do not lose faith. Because this feels like this legal thing, this... Mm, it, it's, it feels like a court case. It feels like a legal case surrounding what I cannot feel what that is at this point but you know Pisces if you know you know and I know you do because this is your lived experience so having the Hierophant as your current energy and leaning heavily into your faith but it, the Hierophant showing up in your area of challenge it I would like to caution you do not lose faith do not lose faith Okay, stay connected and seated deeply in your face because you have the Ace of Cups <clears throat> and the Page of Cups here in your challenge area along with the Hierophant, right? So this is a very this has been a very emotional time for you, Pisces, very emotional and uh, Like you can barely talk about this situation. You're you're highly sensitive about this legal situation. It it really hits a nerve for you, is what I'm feeling. So there are only a trusted few that you will actually talk about this with because it feels like anyone else they just don't understand and they want to. Um, if it was me type thing. And it, if it was me, doesn't matter because it's not them, Pisces, right? So you have a small trusted group of person or persons that you share this with. So you're very sensitive. So your sensitivity kind of, if, if it strikes a nerve, you know, one day to the next, you could be waning in your faith. That is your challenge. And it's important that you are you can you continue to stand on faith 10 toes down right you you continue to do that because here in your outcome this is the most significant card in your reading it's the high priestess right this is very significant to show up in your outcome pisces okay because the mystery will be solved the case will be concluded this legality will be concluded in your favor right that's what i'm feeling um things will start to shift for you and smooth out 
for you is what I'm feeling with this high priestess as your outcome. Uh, your life will feel like it's back in balance. You feel a little topsy-turvy as this has been ongoing for quite some time. Things will smooth out. Um, things will be more harmonious. But what I am feeling definitely with this high priestess in your outcome, this is a very important revelation here that you will come out on top. Things are in your favor with this legal um, situation, right? The mystery is mystery no more because essentially you're waiting to hear how things go if this goes in your favor and it and it does. It does go in your favor because here we have the emperor showing up in your outcome as well, right? This is you gaining control. This is... Um, Everything coming back into balance. Things are stabilizing for you. Uh, the harmony in your life returns. There's less discord or less heartache or less headache with this emperor showing up for you is what I'm feeling. Right? The security, the stability comes back to your life because it's been up in the air for so long. With this ten of wands showing up in your final outcome as well. This is completion. It's done. It's concluded thing. It's fulfilled in your favor, Pisces. So with these cards being revealed here in your outcome, this carries a powerful message for you, Pisces, in mid-May. This These cards, they hold the key to unlocking your true potential, guiding you towards growth, healing, and spiritual awakening. You have the higher fit twice, right? The healing that you need with this high priestess, right? Um, the spiritual awakening is absolutely unfolding with the Hierophant showing up twice for you, Pisces. So pay close attention to the insights these cards have brought forth as they show you. And Spirit has allowed me to share with you the answers you seek, okay? I want to pull uh, an oracle card for some advice, some final advice from spirit for you, Pisces. Okay, there it is. So let's get final advice from spirit for Pisces for mid-May 2024. Many meanings, misunderstanding, duality. Many meanings, misunderstanding, duality. So what I'm feeling with this card for you... <sighs> Lean into your wisdom more than anything because so many things we encounter throughout the day can have many meanings and things could be lost in translation, miscommunicated, misunderstood. So don't take things too personally. Rely on your wisdom to understand what's happening in front of you, to understand the person you're communicating with so that the misunderstandings are lessened or avoided altogether because so many things have many meanings. We are all, we all live with dualities, the light side, the shadow side, the yin, the yang, and we could be easily misunderstood, any of us, and we can easily misunderstand others. So just be sure to use wisdom as you move throughout the um, move throughout your world, in your workplace, in your community, in your home, Pisces. Okay, so it's. I hope this is really resonating with you. Mid May is absolutely a time of growth for you, Pisces. A time of reflection and transformation. The challenges you face are the opportunities for personal development and spiritual evolution. Okay, so embrace the wisdom. Embrace the wisdom that you hold. Embrace the wisdom of the tarot. Trust the universe and know that you have the strength to overcome any obstacles that come your way. May this reading bring you the clarity and guidance you need to navigate this period with confidence and grace, Pisces. Okay? So if you resonate with this reading, don't forget to like this video. Leave a comment sharing your thoughts and subscribe to our channel for more tarot readings. Stay connected with us as we journey through the mystical realms of the Zodiac together. Wishing you love, light, and abundance on your path. Beloved Pisces, see you in the next reading.